log in, but Annette, what I was just telling Sandra was I forgot to record it. So I'm going to actually do the training again and record it this time. Okay. So. Oh, good. Cool. <laughs> then I'll stick around and listen to it one more time. <laughs> Hi, Annette. Hi. All right. Can you guys see the screen now? Yes, ma'am. All right. So this is um, just in time training for financial transactions. This is how to enter those transactions into your M2 system. Uh, service unit and troop entry is almost identical, but I'll go over how to do both sides of it. This is the troop dashboard from here. You would click on banking and payments. And this is where you're gonna see um, your troop. If you've got multiple troops, you'll see each troop there. So you click on the appropriate one. You can either add Girl Scout payment from here, and this is where you would select your Girl Scout and enter the information. Or if you wanna see the details for that Girl Scout, you would click on her name, and it'll give you a list of all payments that have already been entered. And this includes online direct ship, um, sales, or anything that's been paid for online. You click your Add Girl Scout Payment. You enter in the information, your amount, the date, your form of payment, and any comments, receipt number, or anything else that you have. And then click Record Payment. From here, if you you know see it and you're like, oh, wait a minute, that was supposed to be $10, not $100, you would click on it, update it, and then record your payment. If for some reason you've accidentally entered too many transactions, um, like you duplicated one, the little X icon on the side will delete that payment. Okay, Oops, did not mean to go all the way back to the front. All right, also from here, um, you can see your manage ACH. All that, all that is, is it shows you your banking information. So please review it to make sure it's correct. If it's not in here at all, then you're one of the few troops that have not submitted their ACH to me and you shouldn't have received your product at this time. I need that ACH form and you can also enter in the information here. If something has changed or if you notice a number is incorrect, um, you can update it here as well and then you would click save. Um, again, for the service unit, it is almost identical. You log into your service unit go to banking and payments, find the service unit. Most of you will only have one. There are a few of you who will show several service units. Um, and then you're able to click on the troop from there. And then again, record the payment in the same way. The only time a service unit person would be handling payment or entering payments is if the troop um, fall product person is having trouble and needs some assistance and you're just trying to lend a hand. Um, but for the most part, everything should be handled at the troop side of it. I'm going to go back to troop real quick. Um, I am going to go over more in more detail the report section on November 13th, but I do want to just cover real quick uh, the importance of entering those payments. And actually, I'm going to go back real quick. I'm going to re-enter that payment that I have so we can see how it looks. Okay, so you go over to your report section and this will show uh, all of the Girl Scouts in your troop, how they are doing sale wise. If you click on a Girl Scout, it'll show all of the orders that they've um, received from online and in person. You go over to your summary report. This is gonna be the um, report that you will need to have. This is a very, very important report and will be um, needed for your financials at the end of the year. And again, I'll go in more detail on the 13th, but it'll show you, give you a breakdown of your entire troop, how much has been collected online. So if you've had any payments um, made by credit card that have gone into council account, that will show here. Collected from customers, it just hasn't updated, which is why it's not showing um, the amount I just entered. But this will be in everything that you have entered from the customers directly from the girls, what your troop uh, will be receiving 
um, at the end what you should have left for your bonus rewards or recognitions and proceeds. Amount due to council. This is how much will have to be paid to council overall. But keep in mind that this will also include um, online sales too. This will, the payments made to council is anything that has already been ACH'd, which we will not ACH until December 2nd, or anything that's been paid by credit card online. Um, so for the moment, this number and this number will most likely be the same. Your balance due to council will be what will be ACH'd in December. All right, so if you aren't sure how much is gonna be withdrawn, come to your summary report, your balance due to council, and that's gonna be your uh, withdrawal amount. Okay, and then it'll give you a little bit more of a breakdown from here. Um, there was something else I wanted to say and I forgot what it was. Oh, if for some reason you've actually collected more online than um, what is actually owed to council, this number may show up as a negative, um, in which case council will actually owe you um, a little bit of funds back. None of that will be happening until after the ACH in December. Um, and then I will go through and see who still has um, proceeds left. But most likely you're gonna still have some amount that will get paid. All right, any questions? Yes, ma'am. Yes, go ahead. Uh, so when I enter the, the girl payments into the system, will it automatically subtract what is still owed or will that still be reflected there? It should show automatically. Let me see, I think mine was just not updating yet. Let me go in. Because what it should do is it will, oh yeah, it's not even showing the amount that I entered yet. Yeah. So it, it will, it may take a little while for it to update, but once it updates, sorry, our emails are all of a sudden going crazy. Um, it should, when you go into your reports, it will show how much has been paid um, and collected. Okay, so the balance due to council will go lower and lower and lower the more payments that enter, right? Oh, no, 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 sorry, I misunderstood. No, um, when you enter the girl payments, that's what you're entering into your um, bank account. The amount due to council is what you still have, what will be withdrawn from the ACH. Oh, okay. Um, is it, does it reflect anywhere how much is still owed or is that just something I have to track on my own? No, the summary, the summary report will be where it um, will show. Um, let me, since you're the only one in here at the moment, give me one moment. That's not what I wanted. Come on. Okay. So this here is the troop. Um, so this will be uh, everybody's balance, what they owe and what you'll need to enter. All right, when you go over to your troop summary. Andrea, could you go a little bit slower on that so we can see where you're going because your mouse is a lag. <laughs> sorry, I forgot about that. Um, sorry, I went back over to reports. Uh, give it a second, it is still lagging. Let me try that again. All right, under finances and reporting, I went to troop summary amount due. Mm -hmm. Under troop, it will automatically show you yours. Right. Um, there we go. Um, so here is what's been collected online for mm -hmm. your troop. Here is what um, you've collected from customers. This is what the troop will make. This is what it will um, be due to council overall. Uh -huh. um, payments made to council. I don't know why that is not reflecting. I need to look into why that's not reflecting because those two numbers should actually be the same. Um, so I need to look into that. But then this is going to be what's due. Okay. So yeah, let me let me look into that and see why that's not. I, I think Sandra, am I right? You're, I think your question was, how do I see what I haven't input yet? Basically. Like yes. how do I know what, okay. Okay. So how, can you show her how to see what she has and has not input already? 
Yeah, so under reports, under um, your all sales, again, it'll already show your troop information. Mm -hmm. um, so let's say, we'll go with my daughter because I don't have, I don't mind that. Nope. My apologies. I'm in the wrong one. Banking and payments, not reports. All right. So you click on your Girl Scout. Um, when you click on her name, it'll show everything that has been entered. In this case, um, that I would have entered, right? Yes, that you would have entered, which for Catherine, I didn't, I haven't made any payments because she didn't have anything owed. So there's nothing there. Mm -hmm. uh, where is one that you have? Have you entered anybody yet? Go in, no. No? Okay. I have the two that pay, but I haven't entered anything yet. Okay. So that would be, you see right here where it says payments made and it's zero yep. all the way down. This is showing okay. that you haven't made, uh, put in anything in yet. Okay, but each girl, it'll subtract the balance due, right? Like, um, let's say Kayla owes 281. Let's say I enter 50 bucks that somebody paid. Mm -hmm. It'll subtract it, right? Yes. So, okay, good. That's all I wanted. So I'll, and I'll show you how it looks. And I can always go in and delete it. Okay, so that's, we got that. So then you go over here and you see where it says $50 and now her balance is two. Perfect. Perfect. That's all I need, really. Yeah. It's a lot easier when there's somebody that has a balance that I can go in and do that with versus the zeros. So, all right. Does that answer your question better? But parents can't enter that. Only I can enter that, correct? Correct. Parents okay. do not have access to that at all because it's a completely different side of the site. Cool. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. Any other questions? No, ma'am. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah. All right. And that is actually all that I've got. And now that I've actually recorded that one. <laughs> so Yay. other than that um thank you so much for taking the time and joining me and i see we had maria as well join us i think that was maria yeah do you have any questions maria <laughs>